grasp the lid of the container with your little finger, rotate the bottle, flame the mouth of the bottle, reach in with your syringe and draw up, in this case, 0.5 ml, flame the mouth of the bottle again and seal the bottle up. doesn't want to go. There we go. What I'm then going to do, I'm just going to peep underneath the lid. No lifting the lid off to do this. Onto the surface of the agar. That syringe will go into the discard bin shortly. And then I'm going to reach underneath with the hockey stick. And I'm just going to very gently spread it over the surface of the agar. Remember that most bacterial contamination will come down from above. So if you can protect the surface of the agar and your bacterial culture, you minimize the chances of contamination. Finish off by sterilizing your glass rod in the flame and that's how you can do a spread plate. Don't forget when you do anything like this, to put down what you've done. So we had Micrococcus luteus spread plate and your initials. And if you want to, you can add the date as well. It's always best when you're labeling uh, plates to write around the edge. As you'll soon discover, if you write across the middle, um, it obscures the growth of the culture and you can't actually see the results.